Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. On this day, September 19, 1827, Jim Bowie attended a duel between Samuel Wells and Dr. Thomas Maddox on the sandbar upstream from Natchez. After exchanging two shots with no injuries, Maddox and Wells shook hands as friends. But afterwards, a violent fight broke out between the 16 or so men who were present. Bowie, a supporter of Maddox, was severely wounded. He was shot, beaten in the head with a pistol, and stabbed in the chest with a sword by Major Norris Wright, a supporter of Wells. As Wright advanced to stab him again, Bowie pulled the man down onto the point of his big Bowie knife, killing him. Bowie was shot twice more and stabbed by another member of the group. The fight left four men dead, another four wounded. This dramatic example of frontier violence received national newspaper coverage and the fame of Jim Bowie's big knife spread around the world. Bowie survived the sandbar fight, but he died fighting for Texas independence at the Battle of the Alamo in 1836. Hi, I'm Travis Patton, Sheriff of Adams County, and I want you to know that dueling is illegal here in Adams County, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.